ba 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 but I did enjoy it. But yeah, so I need some fluffiness in my life right now. So thanks to everyone who watched that video, by the way. It was a dif different kind of format. I'm gonna still, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do those kind of videos again soon. It, by, I only did that one on the fly because of, I couldn't believe what I was listening to and reading about, about that particular subject. Hopefully have another one out, I don't know, sometime at some point with a bit more improved um, vocalage. I should say, because I think some of you might have noticed because I was reading and for some reason I read I read faster than I can speak. So I was like slipping up my words where I, when I'm talking to you by you, I'm, I'm, I'm always I'm always off script. I don't script anything. So this is why you know, my natural way of speaking. But with that video, I was reading a lot. So I, I tend to slip over myself, but I did enjoy it. So but anyway, we have a different video breakdown and no, no, it's not a reaction video. A few of you have asked about, can I look at a channel called, what's it called? The Darkest Secret. Now, I don't think I have before. I mean, let me know if I have before. I don't know. I, I watch a lot of stuff. But we're going to look at The Darkest Secrets. Uh, the video is called Six Scary Ghost Videos That Are Petrifying People. We'll see about that. Is it going to be petrifying? Is it going to be bullshit? Let's find out. I don't know why I'm doing Callan all of a sudden, but anyway. <laughs> oh, by the way. Um... Please go to Darkest... What are they called? <laughs> the Darkest... I keep wanting to say Darkest Hour for some reason. We're not We're not in World War II here. But uh, we, keep, please go to Darkest Secret, which I've linked down below. Like and subscribe. Watch it and we'll see what we can see. Buckle up, buckarinos. <laughs> Buckle up. I've been watching Third Phase lately, so... I'm rambling and I haven't even bloody started. Have you ever experienced real terror firsthand? A fear so extreme that it paralyzes you. For those new here, by the way, I do um, pause a lot. I talk a lot. And these th th these are not debunking videos, right? If you come here, you didn't debunk anything. These are not debunking th uh, videos. These are the kind of videos I look to find. Hmm, I want to find out how that's done. That's what this kind of video is. You know, a breakdown and analysis. But no, we do not debunk stuff here. Sometimes they'll be on the fly, you know, saying, oh, look, I can see that string. I can see that piece of bollocks right there. That's what we do here, but anyway. There are very few times when you are it's immersed so in a situation that, so that triggers all of your senses. Do you think that you will feel the same? TikTok! <laughs> it's a bloody swing! The, the swing, which swings on its own, is a, has been a TikTok trend for at least two years. But anyway. Stay to find out. It's so loud. My name is Leonor Clay. And this Leonor is... Leonor Clay, I like that name. The Darkest. Secret. The dark is secrets. Today we present six scary ghost videos that are petrifying people. I can't wait! I want Most to be petrified. Most of the videos that you're about to see were sent by my audience. If you know or have videos of this type that you would like for me to see, do not hesitate to send them to my new official Facebook. Do I've been tempted lately? Can, can any, any of you remember the, um, the haunting video I made? Four months ago, I think it was five months ago. I've been tempted to send that to, <laughs> to a few people. You know, the one where, you know, my, my living room was haunted and then Animal was haunted. That that video, it was made before April Fools. The, the, the day before April Fools. Fools. I've been tempted to send that into someone, but at the same time, I don't want to dupe anyone. <laughs> I don't, I don't know, I don't know, but, but, uh, but anyway. At a certain moment, he perceives that something is passing by the side of the road, but due to his fatigue, he thought it was an animal, or that his mind was playing tricks on him. However, the next day, when well rested and clear minded, he began to look at what his dash cam had recorded at that moment. Do you know what, the, I don't know what this woman is narrating, but she would make a very good, um, I think, what, not as ASML, what are they called? Um, like like um, sleep hypnosis things, which I listen to sometimes. <laughs> not to hypnotize myself, but they, they send me to sleep because it's a nice, soothing voice. Like this, and it sends you to sleep. The darkest secret 
I think her voice is pretty good. I like it. I may listen to this to get me to sleep. <laughs> I'm not saying it's boring. It's just sometimes I need things to get to sleep. But anyway. <laughs> I only got a clip yet. I haven't stopped bloody rambling. But right, right, I'm going. Was I supposed to see something then? I missed it. <laughs> oh my god! It's a, a dude! Running down the highway! It was not his imagination. And it clearly was not an animal. Because it's definitely not an animal. <laughs> woman running in the opposite direction. Nonetheless, there is something that he could not see in detail. If you pause the image and apply light correction, it seems that the woman has no head. Ed what? does not know how to explain this. No head? So is it? Is it the highway ghost of Mexico? Or is it a dude running down the highway? And the uh, dash cam is shit. <laughs> it could be that. It could be that the, the dash cam is just not good enough. Just not good enough. Is to use our light. There's definitely they, they have a head, by the way. Now, you can't see the head there because the headlight is focused on the body. But it's such a garbly mess. There's artifacting all over that. Now look look at the quality on that video. <laughs> it's just messed up in that garbly mess right there. Our logical denial. Number five. It shocks me, right? It shocks me. It shocks me that people are so quick, are so quick to jump at, instead of just someone in distress running down the highway, or someone having fun running down the highway, or someone running from their car for because it's broken down and you think, shit, I need to get off this bloody highway because it's dangerous. They're so quick to jump at, no, it's not that. It's a ghost. Think. <laughs> just, just think of it. Just calm down. Count to ten, and just think, hmm, no, it's just a dude, or a woman, I don't know, but, um, but anyway. It's the typing ghost! There's a concerned subscriber who wrote to my email, attaching a disturbing footage to her message. A short recording, without much pretense, like the ones she was used to doing. However, when she checked it, obviously before uploading it, she says that she literally felt paralyzed. <laughs> what is that? Has she got a cat? <laughs> the girl clarifies in her email that she does not own any cats uh -huh. or any other animal. <laughs> Therefore, she assures me that this is a paranormal event. Okay, calm Despite down. Despite her saying so. Okay, calm down now. She assures her that it's a, it's a paranormal event. Now, we don't know what it is. Don't be so bloody quick. But it is, I don't know what the hell that is. Right, her hair is moving. Right, her hair is definitely being physically moved by whatever the hell that is flicking back and forth. It disappears frame by frame. It's behind the hair. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't bloody know. To me, it looks like a cat paw pawing at the back of her hair, but she's adamant she had, doesn't own a pet or cat. We're taking her words for it, don't forget. No, like, I, I usually have an answer or, like, an opinion where I think it might be. I have no bloody clue. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. No, I do not think it's paranormal, before you ask. <laughs> yeah. But whatever that is, I have not got a bloody clue. It does look like a cat paw pawing, you know. No, like how cats can be assholes. I love cats, by the way. No, cats can be assholes, and they'll just pour stuff or like hit things with their bloody paws. You know, cats, cats like to do that, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. I haven't got a bloody clue. So moving on. Number four. The following clip came to me thanks to William Garcia from Mexico, who sent me a video that has left me thinking for several days. It was not until he reviewed the video to post it on his social networks 
Then he noticed something strange. Let's see if you realize it for yourself. Come on, let's have a look. What are we looking at? What are we looking at? Wait, you noticed it, right? Wait, I just saw did something. I just saw something. Did I? Did I just see something? I'm sure I saw something behind that box then. But it was, I was looking at the center behind by the by the band. I wasn't looking at the box properly. Or was I just seeing something? <laughs> I don't know. I did see something. You noticed it, right? I did notice it. Did you notice a sort of hand with yes, black I did. fingers that appears <laughs> behind the box? I see that. The glass also moves towards the box. <laughs> I generally don't know what that is. No, I do not think it's paranormal, but it's... There's some bullshittery going on here, I can tell you that much. Actually, whatever that is, is physically there. I want, I'd love to see the original video of this. <laughs> that is weird. I must admit that is bloody weird. But I really need to see the full video of that. It's not often this happens. I'm stumped. Stumped. Not because I think it's paranormal, but I am stumped. <laughs> I may have to look deeper into that one because I need to take it into my um, editing software because the YouTube um, frame by frame is not that it's not very good. You can't zoom in, you can't do all kinds of stuff with it. So I'm gonna have to look at that one a bit closer. Now we can't we can't seem to see the left of that. I know we saw it in the beginning, but the camera moves in, and you don't see the left behind that box until the camera comes back out and obviously there's nothing there but the box does it does look like a, it has like a flap there mind i'm totally grasping now by the way I, i'm fully aware i'm grasping i don't know i don't know the, the way the person moves the box moves it forward almost to grab the candle thing and then pull back i think there's some bollocksness going on here I mean, we don't even know if it is actually for a funeral. <laughs> I don't know. It has got me right now. I must admit, it does have me right now. Like I said, not because I think it's paranormal, but I have no idea how that's done. The only thing I can think is done, and I'm fully aware I'm grasping right now, is that it's a trick box. And there is something because the the thing the black fingers they don't look like a human hand or whatever they look like plasticky style um, fingers. I don't know. I generally don't know. I'm stumped. <laughs> I'm stumped for now. We shall move on. <laughs> I think it's a trick box because the, the the fingers actually look plastic, but I don't know. I will look deeper into that one. On TikTok. TikTok. She says to see the person that is swinging disappear when they reach the middle. She asks us to analyze it to see if what she sees is true. You can see the person there swinging, by the way. But what I don't get, right, is how... Now, TikTok... How old is TikTok? How old is TikTok? When did TikTok begin? TikTok was released in 2016, okay? 2016! Look at how shit... That camera is. Look at how terrible that camera is. That is why you cannot see the person. There's a person there swinging, guaranteed, 100%. But because, because the camera they're using is so shite that the um, the uh, the onboard ISO settings of the phone camera is not good enough for the darkness around. So it's trying to highlight certain areas, and obviously because it's motion. It's not finding the person which is clearly there. That's that's all there is. And the TikToker, right? The TikToker taking the video is full of shit. <laughs> they can see the person with their own naked eye. 
But they looking, they're like, oh my god, you're not showing up on the, the, the phone camera. I better send this into a top five ghost channel. <sighs> TikTok, I, I really don't like TikTok. <laughs> I'm good. I don't like TikTok for various reasons, right? It's not just the paranormal stuff, but the paranormal bollocks, which you 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 find in TikTok. There's other reasons. I'm actually gonna make a video of the, like I don't know five reasons why I fucking despise TikTok. <laughs> but anyway, moving on. The first of them corresponds to an exploration carried out somewhere in England. The subject oh, you see on camera was the one who did exploring with Danny. Exploring with Danny, I made a video on him over a year ago. Um, he makes, he says himself they're not real. No, he says it, but when he first started out making these stuff, he's like, "Real demon stalks me through the woods with a chainsaw, and they cut me up, but my arm comes back. My arm gets cut off, but it comes back." He makes <laughs> so stupid. I haven't made a video on da uh, exploring with Danny for over a year because uh, he's, he finally started saying it's just a, it's just entertainment, and whether you find that entertaining, I don't know. But um, I'm just going to skip this. Exploring with Danny, uh, who is I think either boyfriend or married to exploring with, with Felicity. I don't know. They make the similar kind of things. They, I don't I don't think they still uh, report themselves as real ghost hunters, but I think they just make entertaining stuff now. So. So I'm, I'm just going to skip this way. I know people don't like me skipping, but it's pointless. It's like m me trying to say that Scooby-Doo is not real. <laughs> so what is the point? You already know that. So moving on. I don't know what I'm looking at. Look at the, look at the state in that uh, video over there. Could it be the weeping one? It's the Leia Rona! Fucking, I can't. I can't watch this shit. <laughs> I cannot watch that shit. <laughs> oh my word. My word. It amazes me that people lock this kind of stuff up. It does. I'm being too cynical now, I do apologize. <laughs> the image you see corresponds to the moment when the young man you see on the screen was trying to remove a large moth that had entered his home. However, when he was about to catch it, something completely alarming happened. Moths are terrifying. Watch. I don't know where I locked that. What it? What happened? <laughs> Why is the music going on next? Oh my god. For fuck's sake. I'm fucking done. Fuck it. I, can't, I can't watch this shit. I can't. I'm done. I'm done. What a load of shit. How's your day today? <laughs> what do you think it is? <laughs> Look at this bullshit. I just can't anymore. I can't anymore. How much longer have I got this? Swan. We're done. Awesome. <laughs> that was... <laughs> oh my word. Honestly. Sometimes I think... Should I be making this video? Is there any point to upload in this video? That's why I sometimes think sometimes when I make when I make when I look at like a certain channel and like is this entertaining? Is this entertaining? Just oh, I don't know. I don't know. That was darkest hour. I don't know. <laughs> I want to read the comments. I want to see if people actually have, uh, pulled in by this. Let's have a look. Let's have a look what the comments say. Uh, never stood, understood hunters of the paranormal that intentionally go out to look for their paranormal then run away. I agree. I bloody agree. <laughs> the hand coming out of the box grabs the candle. See, I think the hand is in the candle as well. Thank you for realizing exploring with Danny is a hoaxer. So there you go. Look, Darkest Hour even knows he's a hoaxer. I, I, I skipped it, so I don't, I don't know. 
I'm so tired of seeing him featured on channels and even on TV shows. I agree. I agree. So yeah, mo thankfully, most of the comments in that video are like, what a load of shit. They, they're not hating, you know, I'm not hating on Darkest Hour, by the way, you know, but the, the clips, what a load of bollocks. <laughs> what was that? Did you hear that then out in my kitchen? Might be my kettle, I don't know. So that was the darkest hour. Um, I've never watched them before, I might watch them again, who knows. That last clip, what a load of shit. <laughs> moths are scary. Don't get me wrong, moths are scary. But anyway. So that's it, I uh, hope you enjoyed. i got a couple of videos which I'm going to make over the next couple of days. Different kind of videos, I'm hoping, fingers crossed. And yeah, that um, that was Darkest Hour. What, what was the, what was the video called again? Six scary ghost videos that are petrifying people. Now, I must admit, the only one which stumped me, and it still has stumped me. I I got my ideas. No, I don't think it's paranormal, but my I got my ideas where I think it is. But it has at the moment stumped me. Is the urn with the, the hand coming out and grabbing the candle candle glass stick whatever? That's the only one. But the others, I'm not even gonna comment on. But anyway. Uh, that's it. Leave a like if you like this video. Leave a sub if you're new to my channel. I do these quite often. Uh, I'll be back again soon. Don't know when. Don't know how. <sighs> Thanks for watching. Bye for now.